So, a Sabbatean that was followed by that of Francis, who were disciples of Jacob Frank, who eventually became an apostle of Judaism by apparently converting to Catholicism. This area of disappointment did not stem the Jewish masses struggling for political leadership. Remember, remember Frank? Frank's the one that inspired Wise out to start the Illuminati with the same principle. Oh, that guy. Okay. Evilistic. He helped start the Illuminati. Saying that he is God, we are God, we are God. Oh, yeah, that we are God for... We are God. Putting yourself at the level of God for the devil. Okay. All the problems considered in the Hebrew catalog is the universal religious issue of the nature and origin of evil. Now, now in the views of some catalog, this conceives evil as a quality of God, asserting that negativity enters into the essence of the absolute. Okay. So in this view, it is conceiving that the absolute need the absolute is evil to be what it is, i.e. Well, to exist, okay? Now, the catalytic doctrine gives man the central role in creation. Okay? The soul and body correspond to the supernal divine that is manifest as nations. In the Christian catalog, this scheme was ununiversalized to describe harmino among the harmony of creation within man. Judaism, it gave a profound spiritualization of the Jewish practice, while the Catholic scheme gave a radically of thought, potentially continuing with development of mainstream and radical and calculated gravitatic motion. I don't remember. So the Catholic thought underscored and invigorated conservative Jewish observance. So the family esoteric teachings of Catalan gave a traditional it's not observance of the central role of spiritual creation, whether the practitioner was learning and following God. Okay, all right. Oh, no, no, no. So, I'm kind of reading normality of Jewish observance and worship of elite mystical Kavanaugh intentions gave them superior power. Okay, okay. But since the figure observance by common folk, especially in the Hadamic, Popularization of Kabbalah to replace esoteric values, many Kabbalists were also leading legal figures in Judaism, such as Azurmanides and Joseph Farrell, right? Yeah, we can go out of the way. I like that aluminum. Okay, so... The human soul has three elements. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay, we're getting there. Now we're getting The Nefesh, Nuash, and the Nehemiah. The Nefesh is found in all humans and enters the physical body at birth. It is the source of one's physical and psychological nature, okay? Is that uh, Illuminati? The next two parts of the soul are not implanted at birth, but can be found on at uh, twins for time. Or develops over time. Their development depends on the actions and beliefs of the individual. They are said to only fully exist when people awaken spiritually. A common way of explaining the three parts of the soul is as follows. The flesh is the lower part or animal part of the soul and is linked to instincts and bodily cravings. This part of the soul is what makes me want to smoke a cigarette right now. This the is an the spirit, it contains the moral virtues and the ability to distinguish between good and evil. And that's the one that says, Man, you can just in there right now. And the higher soul or super soul separates man from all other life forms. It is related to the intellect and allows man to enjoy and benefit from the afterlife. That's, that's what's the one that Bill allows one to have an awareness of the existence and presence of God. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think if I should put this on Bob Melchizedek or Garzuela. I don't know. A section of related teaching spread throughout the Zohar discusses four and fifth parts of the human soul. The Chaya and Yamada. 
I think my fit this on Bob Melchizedek for like rehearsal. This will be like rehearsal. So. We're considered to represent the subliminal levels of intuitive cognition and to be within the grasp of only a few chosen individuals. The Chi and the okay. Chia not enter the body like other three. Thus, they receive less attention in the Oh, everything. dark prophecies. I like dark prophecies. <laughs> Congratulations, you just got on the Bob Melchizedek channel. Oh, you do your bar mitzvah and you get the rest of your soul back. Okay. So once you do your bar mitzvah, you get to have your your whole soul back, or what? Yeah. Okay, that makes. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't accept that.